Hey up Chuck, how you doing? My name is Frankie Forcliffe and today we're going to be on the job, one of the best jobs in the world, Forklift the Simulation. It's not just a simulation, it's a way of life. Forklifts are a man's duty in life and I'm here to uphold that standard as much as possible. We're going to be showing you today how to do a bit of forklifting. So, are you forking ready? Fucking Jesus. Each day is a mission for us, and as it will be a mission for you to get through this day with me. On the start of the job, we start our engines much like we do during intercourse. We ignite it, and if they're disappointed by the end of the day, it's their loss, isn't it? Now to get moving, we must... Oh, well, sometimes it is eager to know that your forklift can sometimes stick into the ground. As is customary, you bring your forklift up as such to get the crates. We usually handle quite a lot of plates in this. Sometimes we are, uh, 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 let's say, uh, handling candies, sometimes animals, sometimes people. Sometimes people end up in these boxes. This one, in particular, has a lot of people in it. Now, it's enough to lift the box up, but we also have to make sure that it's balanced upright, so as it doesn't fall off the edge and kill all the bodies that could possibly be inside. And now we must go to the front where the square block is. Life has a way of finding pickups and pick downs. Pick downs? Fucking Jesus. Fucking wanna kill myself. Here we go. We're going to drop this into our designated place. And that, oh Jesus. Oh, it's still, it's still stacked, but don't worry. We managed to get it onto the block. I don't think I'll be getting that wage slip anytime soon for that lack of behavioural standards. What even am I saying anymore? Now, you've got to try and turn around for this, but you might have to go forward and do a whole 270 degrees. Once we're lined up with the box, we must then go inside. Now sometimes, like all forklift jobs, you can change your camera angle. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ, this is not how I wanted my day to go. Now. Oh, where are we going? Where are we going? We need to come back. There we go. Don't go too far. It's a bit tricky. Once your forks are in the holes, you lift. I don't know if that's how you do things in your bedtime routine, uh -huh. but that's the way I like to do mine. And we have safely secured our first or second box. Now this one contains old ladies' knitting equipment lost at retirement homes that have been blown up. Dare we give them back to their families? No, it's just funnier this way. How's that sound? <laughs> it's no time for fun and games. We can't laugh in here. That is a deduction off of our wage. <sighs> My wife's gonna fucking kill me. A job's complete. The job's done. And that is the mission at hand. That is a secure day's work. But we've been forced to work overtime, so it's now time to go to mission two. I really, really want to end my life. Now, once the forklift has landed from the roof, we, we have to get, don't, don't question it. We must start our engine once again, lift our forklift barriers up, ready to go for the next day. Now, some of these are on lower shelves and upper shelves. This is a real, real risky adventure for us. We're pulling into our next box right now which is over here. Now some of these consist of boxes or barrels. No, not the sexy kind of barrels. <laughs> anyway, after my retirement fund, I'm hoping to get more barrels in my life, providing I can even do this job properly. Nope, it's not working, it's not working. I'm not lining up properly. And sometimes the forklift doesn't even want to move you to the left. Very bizarre turn of events. There we go, we're getting ourselves in, much like the previous boxes. Once we've got a nice entry point, we can start lifting things up. And it's not working, clearly. It must have been the booze from last night. I am slowly descending into a mass depression. But don't worry, once we've got this box under control, we will be having a liftoff. We'll be having a laugh. Once again, we'll be fucking... 
Oh, this, no, 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 this just isn't going to work at all. Now we've literally fucked this job. But like every forklift game, we can restart our progress. Fucking Jesus Christ, I'm fucking... Might as well have worked for Uber. Picking up useless things to drop them off. Getting a tip at the end of the day, except I actually get a tip. Anyway, all of this is being recorded, so I'm getting fired. After my firing, and my quick fuck up, I might as well get along with what I've got. Which is a heavy duty to uphold. Steady on, steady on, steady on. And we're pulling into our first box once again. Now let's not fuck it up like last time. No, 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 not ha- I can't do this anymore. There we go, this is much more aligned, and now we must pick up the box like so, and bring it over to the green arrows as specified, which you can't find them right now. It is a forklifter's instinct to find it for ourselves. Whilst we're lifting our boxes over, it reflects, helps reflect on our day ahead. Much like when I get home, I'm going to be beaten to death by my wife, as I didn't bring out the milk cartons this morning. Oh, fuck it all. Time to keep going. Many people will complain that this job is much worse than watching paint dry, but I'll argue, watching paint dry is very, very, very boring. It's no life fulfillment. You're just watching things. If there's a forklifting, you get to work it. You've got your machine at hand, your steady beast. There's a very hard time. One thing I do like to do, I like to do Tokyo drifts. Deja vu. I ever been in this place before, hired on the street, and I know it's my time to go. <laughs> Fucking end me. <laughs> We've got 17 minutes left for this, so let's do whatever we can with these remaining. I don't think we've aligned ourselves very well here, but we'll give it our best shot regardless. Right, time to lift these up out of their respective places. Let's deliver them to the destination. Twist it around and bring ourselves onto a steady path. I could be living the life of Riley right now. I could be at home chugging a big Beep. Not today, as I've got a wage to g Oh no. Oh, I might as well eat my own dildos, as I think I've cocked this up majorly. But not to worry, we should be safe as long as we just bring it to our destination. If your items end up dangling by a thread, try and bring them along and bring the salvage with you. And I think we've done it. Not quite, but if we feel as though we need to bring it back there again, then we shall. Now we're moving on to the more difficult tasks. If you can see, should be showing itself a bit more, is a red outline, which tells us that's where our next item is. If we can fucking get there. Oh, Jesus. Now I'm pretty sure that the next box is located somewhere around here. Up there, brilliant. So it needs, means we need to go around the back. I'm gonna fucking end myself at this point. Extravagant, really riveting work. And here we are at our third and second to last package. So now we really need to bring our forklift forks up. Did you get that? Because fork and lift. Fucking God, Jesus fucking Christ. And we're almost in with our next load. We lift it off the top, bring it with us. Oh, no, 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 I think that's- Oh! Oh dear. Oh fucking no! No! Not to worry, hopefully we can deliver these packages upside down. If that's the case, I have a very good idea. Fucking come on. The boss is gonna kill me. My wife's gonna kill me. The world is going to kill me. Let's get in. Nope, that's not going to do it. Looks like we're going to have to turn around once again. Do a complete 180. Almost. Almost. See so if we could spin around. Alright, we might be able to get through with this. Doing hat tricks. And hopefully being able to drag this further back. Of course, these barrels are upside down now. Which isn't the best outcome. Let's drop these barrels off and hope to fuck that that doesn't affect our wage slip, which I'm pretty sure it will. Oh, for God, you know, I'm, I'm fed up. I'm so fed up. I've got no life. I've got no happy fun times. I've got no solace, no justice. I'm not feeling too great. My job is doing really shit today. But like a forklift does, we never give up. 
It is our duty to fulfill the best service to the customer. Fucking customers are fucking right. Let's get to the next stage. Now we managed to fail with one of them. Oh, fucking hell. Getting really angry at this. Go over to the very end. Now I believe this is a box of knickers. Girls knickers. Oh, yeah, I, I'm getting a hard on right now. It's, I can't, can't control this. I can't control my knob. <laughs> this is the box of knickers. Let's go in. Get in there, son. Get in there. Get in there, you rapscallion. Let's reverse. And here we go. We're going to have to properly reverse all the way back, I think. This is a hat trick and a half. Uh, I'm... Ah, uh, no, 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 no. I'm about to mess up royally. I just want to go home. I just... Fuck off. We'll go the normal way this time. It's probably easier to manoeuvre. We're almost there. Let's just get in. Drop off our final box and hope for the best. No, 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 fuck, no, no. Oh, this is bad news. Oh, oh, there could have been someone dead in there. Someone alive who we could have saved, maybe some children. I am going to get a slap bottom for this. Let's see if we can hat trick this. Oh, don't tell me this is blocked off. No, it's not. That's it, that's it, that's it. Oh, Jesus. Oh, this'll do. Hopefully we can still drop off this box and have a way at it. Let's drop it off right here. No, this isn't acceptable. Let's turn around and let's see if we can push that on just a bit further. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, come the fuck on. Oh, I'm... There we go, there we go. And let's spin around. Push this just a little further. Hopefully we can give it a nudge. Well, we pushed it on. We've got six minutes left. I don't think we're able to complete this mission. I've done briefings many, many times before and it's never come out like this. So maybe we can do something about that. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, I think I've got it. I think I've got the idea that I've been craving all along. Let's hope we can move past this just a little bit. Move it back. Come on, let's do this. I don't think we're going to be able to finish this on time. Okay, well, we pushed it like that. This is the worst job I've ever had to do in my entire life. No, actually, it's the best job I've had to do in my entire life. Don't go against your own words, Frankie Forklift. It's the reason why your family calls you the Forklift. This is your duty. Oh, oh. It was all supposed to be a small job, but... We basically cocked it up, didn't we? We can't just get out and spin it. We can't do anything at all. We can just hope for the worst. We're not making this on time. There's no way. Oh, wait. Oh, we might have it. In just the nick of time, when all hope was lost and I thought I'd lost my testicles, we might finally have it. Get inside. Lift this up accordingly. Oh, come on. Yes, yes, yes. We might just have this the way we wanted it. And job completed. Oh, I'm going to have to have a frank masturbation after this, and it will probably take about five faps. That's right, five faps. How does that sound? And there we have it, folks. That is the forklift simulation. It's the most thrilling, exciting, rage-inducing, and often most complicated. Why am I even defending this? Fuck it, I cannot do this anymore. Nope, not this. Not this job, not any other job. I'm going to go be a hooker, and I'm going to be a damn fine hooker. You can call me Isabel Laquisha. Oh. Never again.